Hey, what's up guys? It's Austin here. So I just got back from my local comic book store and I found something really cool and that is the Stan Lee Patina. So I think if you guys are watching my channel, you must be huge superhero fans and I'm sure you guys know that Stan Lee sadly passed away this year. So rest in peace Stan Lee. He was definitely a huge, huge part of my life because he created so many of these awesome characters that I dedicate so much of my time to kind of talk about and read about and watch. So it's definitely sad, but this is definitely really cool and it's gonna be something to kind of remember him by. So here is the box, guys. So it says Pop Icon. So it says Stan Lee and almost like a signature. Uh, item 7, I bought it for $13.99 at my comic book store. You can see the box art looks really good and everything. Uh, it says Stan Lee in yellow. Then on this side, we just get a little bit of box art. And then on the back, obviously, there's no other pops in this line. It's just kind of a special pop. So it says the Hero Initiative here. So you can donate to help uh, other authors and kind of artists and so on that um, basically help out with comic books nowadays. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you check that out. Uh, on the side just says Stan Lee and then on the top a little bit of an image there and then the bottom and let's take them out of the box. Something really cool about the box too guys is some of the pops actually have secret messages on the lip that kind of gets tucked in here. So this one says Excelsior, so that's kind of Stan Lee's thing. He always says that. So that's just something really cool that Funko added to the box, a little secret message. All right guys, so here is Stan the Man. This thing looks really, really good. So it's got like a rustic look, almost like the Statue of Liberty because the paint actually, or the metal deteriorates over time. So this looks really, really cool. He's wearing his basic, just kind of like a jacket with a belt, uh, just kind of like basic dress shoes. He has his hand up. Um, not really sure exactly what the pose is or anything, but it's just a pretty basic pose. You can see all the little paint coloring. Um, it looks really, really good. He's got the mustache, there's classic glasses on and everything. The hair sculpt is unique too for uh, Stan Lee Pops, so that looks really, really good. And the paint deterioration actually looks really, really good. Like each hair strand um, actually has like this green that's coming through, so that's really, really good. Uh, whoever did the paint job on these Pops, they did an amazing job because this thing looks legit. It looks almost identical to how a real kind of metal statue would deteriorate like this over time. So that's really, really cool that Funko was able to do that. Uh, there is another side view. And let's just turn them around to the front again. So once again, this is definitely one of my favorite pops that I own right now. Um, if you guys are a fan of Marvel, Stan Lee, or Funko in general, you definitely need this pop. Uh, especially while it's going for retail price because I feel like the resell on this is going to be ridiculous. I think on Pop Price Guide it's already up close to like $25, $30. So make sure you guys pick it up soon so you don't have to pay resell value. And once again guys, just rest in peace to Stan Lee because he was a huge part of my life and everything that I kind of do with my life now. So once again, guys, just leave a comment below of what you guys think about this pop. And also if you guys have picked it up or not. And if you guys like this video, please like it down below and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.